Well, the American dream, I think, to some extent, has been mischaracterized as, you know, who's the richest or who has the most things. Fundamental in the American dream is that it's your dream. The American dream is being able to be successful however you define success. I think we want an environment where people can achieve their dreams uh, and uh, be a success up to potential. It's as true today as it was, you know, 250 years ago when this country was founded. We've reached a time in our country where our republic is at stake. People have gotten so far away from the fundamental principles that made this into a great country. We don't understand our history. We don't teach our history. And the tough lessons that we've learned and that we've grown from. You hear a lot of rhetoric about the Constitution, but not much understanding of what it implies. Because I think if people really understand the history of our country, the foundation, the Constitution, and why it works, it makes you patriotic. The United States is the most successful multi-ethnic country in global history. How do we keep this dream alive? Because it has to. We're going to do anything to make sure the United States never falls into the hands of those people that destroyed my country. Because we know what it's like to live in a country where we don't have those opportunities and we don't take it for granted. Every generation has to decide if they're going to rededicate themselves to the American dream. And so when you look at America in its entirety, you have to look at the good, the bad, all of the journeys that have brought us to this point.